Now, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are gonna play uh, Deus X, Deus X, Mankind Divided on GOG Galaxy 2.0. You can combine all your games, all your friends in one location. Sit back, relax, let's have a good time. Thank you so much to the developers and sponsors of the stream, uh, and my YouTube and everything. Um, Zozo wants to come in. Come on, child. So you might be seeing him here shortly. Uh, what is exclusive? Oh yeah, let's do exclusive. Why not? I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. The setting requires a very large amount of vivid memory. I can do it. All right. Let's do that. How do we start it? Right there. Hot dog. And also, it is not going to be hot in here, and I'm so excited about that. Uh, Honeywell just sent me a air conditioner. That is brand new. It's a dual hose. I don't, you guys can't even hear it, I don't think. But we'll find out once people start talking a lot. But, um, yeah. You guys shouldn't be hearing it. But it is hella cold in here now. And I love it. Oh my gosh, did the game crash? What just happened? Let's try again. When it fails, try it, try again. I don't know why it would fail like that. Okay, let's try again. Maybe an antivirus that's not on my system is doing it. Start. What do you think, Zozo? Zozo loves the new air conditioner. Cause he's so sweet. He's so little. He's right here. He's right here. There he is. There's little Lord and Savior Zozo. Cute baby. Alright, so maybe we have to change up some settings. I guess. Is this normal? Is this. I've never played this game. I don't... Is this normal, Zozo? What do, you... what do you think? Let's change up some options, see what's going on. Probably that's not a thing. Maybe that's what's screwing things up. Okay, full screen. Yes. Everything amazing looking. Yes. We have a Zozo here. Yes. Look at him. Look at him. Okay. 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 Zozo, I need to turn the light so people can see you. All right. What do you think of that, buddy? We'll put him right here because he gets a bigger camera than what I get. Watch, he's gonna come back over here. Yeah, he loves me. Yeah, and I love you. Yes. Okay, let's try to play it. It was probably the three that threw it off. So, a brew hype. How you doing, brother from another mother? Dude, dude. So this game ain't starting, and I don't know why. Amelia, how you doing, sweet pea? Why is the game not starting? So this is Man D D Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Maybe I should try to start the game before the stream. I don't know. I don't know. Might be a thing. All right, let's see what else we can not screw up. Uh, maybe a strike deck 12. Is that it? I don't know. What do you think, Zozo? What do you think the issue is? Zozo's my smart little guy, huh? Can you guys hear the AC going? Can you guys hear that machine in my room? Because it's not very loud, but it is really good. Oh, it was DirectX 12! Not Parrot, how are you doing? Welcome to the stream. 
You must be a follower because I only have follower only mode on. Nope. Good. Good, good, good. I'm so glad you guys can hear it. You're not new to the stream? Oh, you are a follower. Hi. So I'm so glad you can. We can play the game now. So that's exciting. Uh, should we check out graphics in the game? Ooh, restart is acquired. Wow, I am really going crazy on this game. Let's just make everything. Improve shadow quality. Yes. I hate motion blur in every game. Yep, the field's all right. What is this? Yes. I want you guys to be happy. Level of detail, very high. Not Parrot, where are you from? You are new to me. Okay, so we got very high going. Let's change some of the controls because that's what I do. <sighs> I don't know if all this is gonna enter, exit, cover. I guess E, baby. Iron sight. Grenade? No, I usually... Ugh! How about this? You know... Takedowns. Throw objects? Remote hack? I don't know. Let's do it period, I guess. Okay, all right now. Let's oh wait. We need to go here. It says that we need to go here and we need to turn this to half and You know why we need to do that because we have an awesome system <laughs> All right gameplay I want it to be violent okay good Language I want nothing but foul language. Okay. We need to restart the game. Boy, this is quality content right here. You guys get to see my kitty. You guys get get to play this game, huh? Are you guys glad I added this right camera? So you guys can see what Zozo looks like when he's literally snuggling me. You guys like that camera? my little bad friend. Maybe you guys can hear him purr. Hopefully. Makes everybody happy. But how's everyone doing? Amelia, kitty cam for life. Okay, so we'll keep the kitty cam. I need to add a couple more kitty cams so we can get different angles. Because I want you guys to be able to see from that angle. if So you can see his belly. And then the other angle, so precious, right? The other angle is when he's sitting on the PlayStation 4 right here. Super warm. But yeah, he's my baby angel and I love him to death. Alright, have you guys ever played this game? This game better blow your mind. Uh, just give me a story. What? You can enjoy... Say hello to experience, you also relive events which took place years prior by watching a 12 minute recap. Sure! It was 2027. Advances in biotechnology were helping people improve their physical and mental abilities to an amazing degree. Provided, of course, they had enough money. A new breed of people was emerging half human, half machine. And in Detroit, at least, not everyone was happy to see it. I just landed a job as head of security at Seraf Industries, a cutting edge biotech firm. David Seraf himself handpicked me for the job, said he needed me to keep his people safe. My ex, Megan Reed, was one of them. A brilliant neuroscientist, Megan had found a way to make augmentation safe and affordable for everyone. All she had to do was present her research to Congress. But the night before her big meeting, my security measures failed. Oh, no. A team of black op mercenaries stormed into Seraph headquarters, massacring everyone in sight. Three of the mercs were heavily augmented walking tanks. Their mission? Take out Megan and her team. I tried to stop them, but their leader tossed me through <laughs> a plate glass wall. 
Last thing I heard as his bullets slammed into my brain yeah. was Megan's dying scream. I should have died with her. Only I didn't. High end military grade enhancements saved my life. The best augmentation Sarah's money could buy. It took me half a year to get a feel for her. Should have taken longer. But six months into my recovery, Sarah Industries was attacked again. This time, by a radical group of pro-human purists. Oh. Violent, militant, and fanatically yeah. opposed to human augmentation. Yeah, yeah. They claimed to be members of Humanity Front, a non-profit organization that wanted the UN to limit biotechnology research. The thugs broke into Sarah's factory and found machinists working overtime on a top-secret military augment called the Typhoon. Sarif sent me to retrieve it. And when I did, I found one of the so-called purists next to it, wired with cerebral implants, trying to download its classified specs. Obviously, something more was going on. The Og killed himself before I could question him. Sarif such a happy cat, right? So with the help of Frank Pritchard, Sarif's head of cybersecurity. <laughs> I did. Turns out a second hacker had been controlling the AUG's actions from somewhere off site. Pritchard and I tracked his signal to a secret FEMA internment camp in Detroit. The Black Op mercenaries were there. The same mercs who'd left me for dead six months before. Figured they'd try again when they saw me. It wasn't so easy for them this time. I took out the tank named Barrett. Even got him to give me a new lead. A penthouse apartment in China. Of course, we both knew it would be a trap in the end. Hengsha Island, China. Home to a city so crowded, they had to build a second city on top of it. Trying to find clues in Hengsha wouldn't be easy. <laughs> Lucky for me, I wasn't alone. Farida Malik. Seraph Industries ace pilot had lived in Hengsha before. A good person to have on your side. She knew enough about the place to get me around. Malik dropped me in the lower city, close to the penthouse Barrett had told me about. Bell Tower Associates, a private security firm under contract to the Chinese government, had agents tossing the suite when I arrived. Zozo for Supreme Later 2021, right? Was a criminal hacker. He is just purring and purring. Sarah's factory. Van Bruggen's panic decision to force the man to commit suicide had been a mistake. Now his mercenary partners were gunning for him, and I needed to find him before they did. Locating Van Bruggen meant playing nice with the triads, anxious organized crime lords. They had the hacker holed up inside a low rent capsule hotel. By the time I found him, Van Bruggen had no qualms giving up the woman who hired him. Zhao Yun Ru, president of the Taiyang Medical Corporation. According to Van Bruggen, Zhao wanted to monopolize the augmentation industry and had hired black op mercenaries to destabilize her competition. Seraph Industries was at the top of her list. To prove this, I needed to get inside TYM and grab a surveillance hologram off a server. I suspected Van Bruggen was hiding something when he told me this, but nothing could have prepared me for what I saw. Megan wasn't dead. She and her four best researchers had been kidnapped, spirited away somewhere while their kidnappers made it look like they were dead. Desperate to learn more, I confronted Zhao in her penthouse. She claimed to be a pawn in a bigger plan and hinted at a group so powerful it controlled global interests at a whim. Then she slipped into a panic room and hit the alarm, mm. forcing me to make a very quick exit. I figured Zhao was lying, but part of her confession made sense. David Sarif had been worried about his people. So worried, he'd required all of them to have subdermal locator devices surgically implanted. The GPLs would have been broadcasting the day of the attack. Zhao sent a single call to Picus, the world's leader in global 24-hour satellite news, and turned those signals off. I needed to fly to Picus headquarters in Montreal if I wanted to learn more. The 
Eliza Kassan, Pikus Communications' mm. first lady of news. Malik thought I was reaching when I told her. All right, well, that was fun. Let's watch something else. Let's start playing. Huh, so, so. Huh. I once thought I could save the world. Now look at it. In yet another augmented terror attack, 251 passengers aboard Sista Airlines Flight 451 were killed. When an augmented passenger broke into the plane's cockpit and ruthlessly butchered its flight crew. <laughs> Recovered from the black box recorder suggests that the man may have been suffering flashbacks to the AUG incident. That horrible day two years ago when augmented people all over the world flew into a psychotic killing spree, causing the greatest loss of life in recent history. Sometimes you just have to let go and embrace what you've become. Not gonna go all wonky on us now, Hansa. Are ya? Well, if I do, McCree, I guarantee you'll never see it coming. Yeah, Agent Chairman Meowser says, uh, says all humans are belonging to him. Sure. Right? No reason to assume you would. Good. Because you are the only augmented operative on this team, and I intend to make good use of you. Listen up, all of you. We got a sandstorm barreling down our ass, and we can't afford to make mistakes. We're going after this man, an arms dealer named Shepard. He's ex Bell Tower, one of the special forces commanders who disappeared during the incident. And he's come out of hiding. That cannot be good. It's not. He's selling weapons and military grade augments to terrorists. This is Aran Singh, the undercover agent who lured Shepard out of his hole. Best you see Interpol's got. For three years, he's worked hard to get in tight with the Jin, an Iraqi smuggling cartel that's infected the Eastern Hemisphere like a plague. Last week, our arms dealer sent a message to the Jin, offering to sell them a shitload of black market merchandise dirt cheap. They told Singh to handle a buy. They're not gonna like it when Interpol disrupts their party. Singh's cover really that good? It is right now. We need to keep it that way. This is where the deal's going down. A half-finished high-rise hotel that's been abandoned ever since the incident. It's not a pretty picture inside. Let me guess. Most of the laborers were augmented with heavy-duty industrial rigs. So when the incident hit and they all went schizo, things got gruesome real fast. And no one, except for some homeless junkies, have been inside the place ever since. So what's the plan, Director? Singh's meeting Shepard on the ground floor, inside the hotel's main atrium. He sent the bulk of his gin crew to the penthouse levels to secure a vantage point. I want McCready's team to take up positions overlooking the atrium and make the arrest. Jensen, you're going in solo from the roof. My objectives? Keep the gin from joining the party. As far as we can tell, only one route connects the atrium to the penthouse level, a halfway decent elevator shaft. Here. I want you to block access to it. Fine. Just cut me loose. Do you plan on relying solely on your augments for this one? I'd recommend taking a little hardware, just to be sure. I'm not leaving my six exposed. Give me something lethal. Your call, but Singh's undercover in all this. So watch your fucking sights. What about range? There's lots of wide spaces and high ceilings in there but a number of tight and constrained rooms, too. So it's a crapshoot, really. Well, I'm not looking to play dice with anyone in there. Give me something with distance. Your call. Less chance of being seen and compromising Singh that way. One last thing, Jensen. Singh said that Jin are using some sort of portable Wi-Fi device to boost communications. He's got a better chance of maintaining cover if you disable it. Keep an eye out for it. Yeah. There is. 
and we got the intel on this mission at the very last minute. So we're scrambling a little. If it comes to it, your number one priority is keeping the djinn out of that atrium. Copy that. Time to put away your happy thoughts, gentlemen. We're approaching the target building. You're up first, Jensen. Let's do this. Task Force Action. This is Knife Leader. Engage Hush Drives and descend to Angels 1-5. He is just her man. All right, so, so we need to move. Team leader, this is Jensen. I'm on the roof. Solid copy. Move into the building. The access route you need to block is at the far end of the penthouses. And keep in mind, the direct route might not be the easiest one. Roger that. McCready will advise once his team is on the ground. Miller out. Doing this left-handed. There we go. Has anybody ever played this game? Jensen, we're moving through. Oh, fuck. What's wrong? The Jin have got a few Jennies up and running. We're gonna have to hack keypads. You should enjoy it, McCready. They have colors and shapes. Just remember, red means bad. Fuck you. Change that. Uh, 
Let's play with Smart and Cyanide. Let's play with Trace program initiated. Oh no! Oh no! I'm pushing C! I am pushing C! I'm pushing C! It says push C, I'm pushing C. So I don't know if it's not registering. What do you think, Zozo? What do you think, huh, buddy? Eh? What do you think? Mm. I think I love you. You go over the window. Oh, you want to leave? Go. Let's we'll see if C is bound to something else other than what we think it is. What it should be. Hey, nice stream. Hey, Pixel Racers. How you doing, my friend? What have you been up to? Gosh dang it. I don't know why C is not working. See, it, put, it says push C. I'm good, deets. Do you play VR or something? Oh my gosh, yes, all the time. I cover them um, a lot, actually. It's not. Anomaly detected. Oh no! Trace program initiated. Granted. Why does he see? Have you ever played this game? What VR games do you play? Okay, I'll send you a key for our game. Oh my gosh, yes! Mr. Developer, how'd you even find me? Yes, I play VR. I have an Oculus Rift, and I have a Valve Index, and a PlayStation VR. Tutorial now. I think that was the last. Time. 
What's your game called, Pixel Racer? Is it called Pixel Racer? Switch VR? You wanna see VR? You wanna do VR today, guys? Well, I just stumbled on your channel. Well, I'm pretty amazing, so... There's that, Pixel. So you kind of stumbled on greatness, of course! <laughs> I kid, I kid. Listen up. Doppler shows that sandstorm's moving in fast. It's big, and it's gonna hit us. Game is called Bed Tricks. This one in a switch VR is Time is not on our side. Oh, yeah. switch VR. Solid copy. Called Bed Tricks. <clears throat> is it on Steam? Yeah, it is. Oh! It's not VR. Here's a link. Oh, it is VR. Yeah, what's the Steam link to it? Nope. It's alright, you're not in trouble. Wow. Yeah, I'm watching your trailer. <laughs> I was watching it real fast. It's alright, you're not in trouble, bro. I'm not assuming you're sex, but bro. Bad trick. There's two different bad tricks. Uh, okay, I see yours now. May twenty first. Uh, May twenty first. Yeah, bro. Looks dope. Yes, I will play your game. How long do you want me to cover it for? No, Steam's way better, not Oculus Store. No, Steam, Steam! 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 Here, do you have my email? All right, Steve it is, okay. You have my email? Should have my email. I'm really easy to get a hold of. Do I have to do tutorial? <clears throat> That's cool. Looking for a content contact, oh. Yeah, look for uh, where it says content creator. Reach the holograms. That's it. Touch them? Oh, I've reached three or four. Nice. Good game, this. Right, Pandemic? You're a good person. Exit. Tutorial done. All I want to do is murder people in this game. Dematidosha. No, don't TK! You wanna let me progress now? Stop it! Stop now! Uh, congrats on Team X Split. Oh yeah! I've been with him for a while. Yeah, I'm on a lot of teams. X split. 
Web around. Yes, that. I'm kind of a big deal. Just notice below the team. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, does it want me to? No, uh, it wants me to do that. Cool. Oh, that's fun. I don't know why it keeps telling me to do this. Yeah, bro. Hey, how long? How long did you want me to? Uh... Good day now. How long did you want me to uh, play your game, peasant? <sighs> Pixel racers. Oh, you're not a peasant. I'm sorry. Does that mean to say? McCready, how you making out? Slower than expected. <laughs> it's like someone's tilled a fucking cemetery down here. Say again? When the shit hit the fan in 27, the rush must have been from the stairs. There's corpses everywhere. A lot of your cousins are here too, Jensen. You want me to grab you any spare parts? No parts. But I take mine with cream and two sugars while you're asking. Oh, I'm running out of ammo! How do I get more guns? Let's grenade them all. Grenade out! Jensen, watch your 20. Are you Working a Steam curator? Oh my gosh, 27,000 followers. Of course, peasants. Roger that. For me, okay. I'll say you can be a curl, it'll be easier. Oh, hell yeah! I don't have any ammo! Can't find Northdorf though. No, it's hookups. Northdorf isn't a curator group, I'm the person behind it. Smoke out! Take your time. Take your time, smoke. I will crack your. Hey, how do you get ammo in this game? Sir! Okay! Yeah, it's hookups. That's my jam. 27,000. Yeah, it's not Nordor, because no, we're gonna bank off what I already have. You know what I mean? What's this do? Just kill everybody! What does that do? Does that help? What's this? What's that? Oh, it's a gun! <laughs> oh no, what is the kind of gun is this? Oh, I want your gun. You have more bullets? What, like you didn't notice me right there, dude? Yes! Boom! Just All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. Apparently, I'm amazing at it. So there's that. Uh, if you guys like this video, hit that sub button, follow button, whatever good buttons in front of you. If you guys are on the stream, stay tuned. We got more in store. Thank you again to my developers and sponsors that uh, support this stream and content and everything like that. And see ya.